Hey guys, Luigi Taco here, and welcome to part two of Let's Play Pokemon Leaf Green. Uh, in the last part, we got our Pokemon and delivered a parcel and got our Pokédex. In this part, we're just gonna be going on and hopefully get to Verdian Forest. At least that's what I'm planning. Uh, I have guest commentator with me. Yeah. Talk louder. Hey guys, I'm I. Yes. And so yeah, let's just go on. So, last part, our partner mentioned that his sister has a town map, so let's go check that out. Oh, she does. Yeah, that's lazy. And Pingus gets a town map. <laughs> True. Ugh. Alright, so, Route 1. Right as you said that, you jinxed it, man. Alright, normally I'm gonna be cutting out wild Pokemon battles, but this is our first time seeing. Whenever it's the first time seeing a Pokemon, I'll show it. So, this is a Pidgey. It's very weak. I'll just do the honors of killing it just for experience. The episodes of this Let's Play are probably going to be around 13 minutes. I mean, last time it was 10, but I don't know. It'll probably just change throughout the whole entire thing. Oh, is this the other one? Yep, here's Rotata. Wow, a girl. Oh my god. I'm not going to kill this one, just for time's sake. And we arrive in Verdian City. All right, first thing I want. <laughs> first thing I want to do here is, first of all, go up here and to the right, and there is a potion. Yes, potions are good. All right, so got a potion in hand, and also down here. If you go over here, down here, and then turn to the right and walk a little bit to the left, uh, you'll encounter your rival, who will have two level 9 Pokemon, his starter and a Pidgey. And if you're under level, don't fight him. It's pretty simple. You look so shy, you're like, uh, oh, yeah. Oh, Not your grandpa. Yeah. Whatever. Dude, you don't look like him. Because he's too True. Anyway, this guy right here, if you don't... Um, you have to deliver Oak's parcel to Oak. Uh, or else this guy will not let you buy. He'll be like on the floor all dead and stuff. He'll say, oh, I need my coffee. So... Yeah, especially my parents. No, I'm just joking. And he shows us how to catch a Weedle. We don't really need a tutorial, but he just does it to make himself feel special. Was that educational, was it not? <laughs> and we have the TTTV. Basically, it's a key item that you can just go to it in your bag, click on it, and you can watch like a cheesy TV show on how to do stuff. Starring some guy in an, in an undershirt. He looks like a sumo And it's the Poke Dude that no one cares about. So, and something, something a little bit interesting. Uh, oh, I guess he says it later in the game. Well, anyway, uh, the Poke Dude is apparently that dude's grandson, I think. Either son or grandson, I can't decide. Shut up! No, no. You're not the Pokey Dude. Yes. All right. Uh, these NPCs serve no purpose whatsoever, so let's just ignore them. And yes, we hit the Verdian Forest in only five minutes. Came here with some friends. Itching to get Pokemon battles. Yeah, there are a bunch of trainers in here that you can fight. Um, it gives some good experience. It should level up your starter to about twelve, I'd say. Oh, here's a new Pokemon, a Caterpie. 
quite weak as well. Ooh, I should have healed. Whatever. I have a couple of potions that I picked up. So, let us progress. Oh, God. Uh, here's our first trainer. <laughs> Let's see, what's his name? Bugcaster Rick. Oh, here's a new Pokemon, Weedle. It is a bug and poison type. It's rather weak, as you might have guessed. <sighs> so, yeah, that's Strict Shot and Poison Sting. Those are the only two moves it can learn until it evolves. And, yeah. Now, I'm gonna speed up this battle just because, really, there's nothing else to see except for me beating up a bug with a grass dinosaur, so, yeah. Okay, here's another Pokemon, Kakuna. Uh, Kakuna is... The only move it knows is Harden, unless you evolve it from Weedle, which is its previous evolution. And... Oh my god, I, I just broke one of my keys off. <laughs> anyway, uh, that's beside the point. Uh, yeah, all it knows is Kakuna until it evolves it to its final evolution. And, but if you evolve it from a Beetle, then it will have Poison Sting and Shrink, and Shrink Shot, too. So, yeah. There we go. Finally, that thing is dead. Alright, just to save time, I'm going- Ooh, yes, fine with finally a new attack. Alright, with the level up, you leave that battle. Yes. Alright, uh, I'm just gonna skip the rest of the battles and maybe do them off screen. Cause I mean, there's really nothing more to it. Uh, Weedle, Kakuna... Oh god, can I dodge this guy? Okay. Oh god. Ooh, I got lucky there. <laughs> oh, Alright. So, yeah. Um, not a very long dungeon. Ooh, you oh. just heard... Just heard the things cry. Here's Kakuna. Here's a wild one. But I don't really need to fight it. It gives some good experience, but... Sometimes if you walk in an area without, uh, without encountering any wild Pokemon, you can actually hear the cries of some of them. Let me try to get one to appear. There it is. Alright, that was just a Weedle, so, yeah. Just wanted to show that off. I always thought it was kind of cool. See, and you can match up with Cry. So yeah, I always thought that was a little bit interesting. Wow, my ROMs is glitched up. Whatever. You got a Pokeball, or I keep thinking it's gonna be a Pokeball, but it's really a potion. Yeah. Random encounters, you always hate them. 
And here's the last trainer. Up ahead is the exit. As I said, it's not really a long maze or dungeon or whatever you want to call it. And we have a level 9 Weedle. So yeah, let me use Leech Seed, my new attack. Or I mean Vine Web, sorry. Ooh, that did nothing. And also let me use Leech Seed. I sped up during the time I used it, so... Let me just show you what it does, in case you don't already know. Which I'm gonna expect you do, but it doesn't matter. Anyway, after every turn it sucks health from them. Uh, it's a pretty good attack, but there are better ones, so I'm probably going to switch it out someday. So yeah, really that's all there is to it to this battle. Tackle. God, I keep breaking my key off. Ugh. Please, no, no. There. I gotta quit playing with that. 99 experience. Again, not that much if you're, like, a high-level Pokemon, but still. <sighs> I just gotta say, the trainer in this game really got lucky that, like, one of those bug catchers didn't have a level 50 Pokemon. Like, he's pretty dang lucky that he had all Pokemon his level to fight. So, yeah. Alright, we're here at Pewter City. Let me just heal myself. Take my Pokemon. And, no, you don't hope to see us again. Alright, Pewter City, uh, pretty normal city. Uh, there's not really much. There's a Pokemon, there's a gem. Oh, yeah! Here's our first Pokemon gem. Uh, really quickly, if you go up here, turn to the left, and right in the middle, you press A, you find a Pokeball. Yeah. Oh, by the way, this big thing right here, uh, that's a museum that you can pay a little bit of money to go into. It's really nothing special. So let's go into the main interest of this town, the gym. You can talk to this guy. Hi, Ed, you want to drink big? No trip there. Yeah, why not? Get an advantage. Okay, that doesn't tell a lot. And if you read right here, you see something kind of depressing, but already beat the gym leader. If you walk, well, there's a trainer right here, and then there's a gym leader, Brock. I'm gonna fight that trainer off screen, or I don't know. Uh, so yeah, in the next part, we will fight Brock, so see you guys then.